What is up, Guardians? JB here with another Destiny 2 video. Uh, this is going to be Volume 2 of my Into the Blue series where we explore uh, rare class weapons and see how they perform in the Crucible. As always, if you could please hit that like button and the subscribe button. It helps me out. I uh, really appreciate it. Uh, so today we're going to be going into the uh, Armillary PSU Scout Rifle, which I like to consider an alternative to the Tone Patrol, and also the Sand Wasp, which is gonna, going to be very interesting because I don't really use that type of um, assault rifle much. So it should be fun. Uh, so we're going to take these into the Crucible after we just take a quick look at the specs. So this is one of my favorite blue weapons in the game, the Armillary PSU. It's a very accurate scout rifle. Uh, I have a lot of fun with this one. Um, it's got precision frame, so the recoil pattern is more predictable, which is great. The red dot OAS, my favorite, favorite uh, scope on these type of weapons. It has high caliber rounds, which is always a plus, which is good. And quick draw, which is actually pretty good I, I use quick draw um i really like switching between weapons so that works out really well uh the sand wasp my first time using this rapid fire frame i'm not a big fan of the 720 rounds per minute archetype uh but we'll see how it goes it also has high caliber rounds as well so um that should be you know very helpful and we're going to do that uh, i don't get into the really technical specs of things because i don't want to bore you with numbers you can always research that on the internet yourself it also has dynamic sway reduction which i think is a great perk for this type of weapon 720 rounds that's pretty fast fire rate and i always use the brotheration mk28 with these videos uh just to have something in the power weapon slot um so yeah we're going to be using this uh as well so let's jump in and we'll see how it goes okay let's go I love that scope. It's just so clean. I'm still getting uh, used to playing with my Hunter again, as I stated in previous videos. I play mainly Warlock, uh, so I just figured I'd use my Hunter for this to kind of refresh myself on how to use him in PvP. I'm also using the Gemini Jester pants, which I forget that I have on half the time. Uh, I'm still wondering how effective those are. Look how clean that is. Like Such a great gun. The artillery is an amazing gun. It's so accurate, so clean. It's time, Guardian. Crush them. Oh, get away from there. Not sure why I switched weapons there, but whatever. Should have stuck with the other gun. Why we have fire team? Yes, sir. Three minutes remaining. Kill somebody? There we go. Come here, come here, don't run. It's okay. Shh, there you go. Stay strong. Go to sleep. Your killing nice. intent is unmatched, Hunter. I love playing on Sundays because I hear Lord Shax and then I see him on The Walking Dead on Sunday evenings as Morgan. Around here, you're just gonna sit right there. You know, I always watch the radar and see, you know, how a person uh, approaches me because of all the stupid sword guys running around, you know, just camping corners and, and pillars. So, like, if I see a guy who's just, you know, sitting behind a pillar, uh, you know, not coming at me, uh, baiting me to come in, I'm pretty sure he has like a sword. So, if I don't have a grenade to kind of flush him out, I'll actually just sometimes just move along or uh, maybe wait him out a little bit and see if he comes out. So I can't stand swords. Uh, I think they're ridiculously overpowered. Uh, I know everybody has their own opinion about them. But uh, I'm just so used to playing, you know, a little more skill-based gameplay. And I know Bungie has to throw things out there to satisfy people who just can't aim. So I <laughs> hate to sound so mean about it, but um, yeah, the swords just frustrate me. Uh, come on, land my shots, dang. 
<clears throat> yeah, that sucked. Back when I played with the armillary PSU more, I had better timing on those headshots. Uh, it's pretty great when, it, when you can get master the timing down. Yeah, I felt like that took longer than necessary to kill him. Thirty seconds. I was hoping he'd get greedy and jump down on those grenade. Come on. Die. There we go. Ten seconds. Nice. A victory well executed. Eh, I don't know. Um, I love the armillary. I don't think it's the best weapon for this map. Uh, I just picked the first map that came up. Uh, the Sand Wasp, uh, I don't know. I just I just feel like uh, an SMG no would be better that in that spot well than an assault rifle, especially that particular assault rifle. Um, you know, not too happy with how I played, but hey, it is what it is. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, can't wait to put out the next video. Thanks. See you.